Good morning, Cedar Park High School. I'm Austin Makaborski, and I'm here today with varsity volleyball player Maya Cheatham. So how are you today? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm doing really good. That's good to hear. Um, so Maya, what inspired you to become a volleyball player? Um, well, throughout a lot of my life, all my family members went on, or majority of them, went on to play Division One sports. Um, and I think growing up, that kind of like instilled in me just to like get inspired in sports. And like originally, I wanted to be a dancer. So like that wasn't oh, yeah. like yeah, that was like my intention at all. Um, but my sister. Oh, sorry. So what changed there? Like, did you have a your sister, you said? Yeah, so my sister actually started playing volleyball in sixth grade. And, like, I went to, like, a bunch of tournaments with her. And after, like, watching her just see how, like, the sport kind of, like, impacted her life, I was like, okay, I think I want to give this a try. So I did soccer and volleyball. And then after, I was like, I want to do, like, volleyball for the rest of my life. Oh, so, yeah. Nice. Perfect. Um, and then how do you handle the pressure of having this position? You said outside hitter? Yeah. Yes. Um, I think the pressure, definitely, it can be a lot, but knowing, like, my teammates and, like, my training and also, like, my coaches, they always have my back regardless of any situation, and I think that's a big thing of being an athlete and also, like, in the position I am in. Um, so yeah. yeah, perfect. I mean, it's, it's a lot of people thrive under pressure. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Um, so in the games, what was like one of your most memorable moments or even during practice? Do you have like a specific time that you just really remember as like a good time to look back on? A good time to look back on, I definitely say my freshman year, but also this past week when we beat Liberty Hill, mm -hmm. I think that game just completely changed, not just like within like myself, but also like our team dynamic for us this season like right now we're currently like on um so i think definitely that has put like a big like mark on us so I, that's like i'm never gonna forget ever yeah, yeah yeah for sure continuing to be undefeated later too yeah 100 sure. percent. Yeah. well um what skills do you think are essential for being a successful outside hitter um grit fun and determination the big three yeah yep and uh how how do you down how do you balance uh your social life and your academic life and your volleyball practices and you know your games and stuff is right. that a struggle or do you think you can find you found a good way to balance it all i think i found a good way to balance it all i, th I mean some days like it is pretty hard and, like that's just the reality of it all um but like i think as i've gotten older i've realized like okay i need to do this this and this and like all of it will like come together at one point. Yeah, yeah. That's a good way to think about it. And then, how has teamwork been? Like, how has the 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 camaraderie on the team been this year? Um, I think the camaraderie on our team this year has been really good. I think in practice, it's always competitive and high level, and that obviously shows whenever we hit the court. Um, but I also think like it challenges us to like be. I don't know what the word is, but like be more aggressive. Like yeah within each other when we play like in a good way in a I good see. way yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure so like i think like just the mindset of like always going after it in practice like whenever we have time together and like teamwork wise like we're a great team so i think 100%. all of that like comes together anytime we're together totally yeah well yeah uh i think that's all the questions i have today um just one more though uh what do you think you're gonna take this after high school do you think you're gonna play for college yeah so Right now, I'm currently still in my recruiting process, and like, wait, do we do this? Okay. Sure. Anyways, oh uh, yeah. So, um, recently, I went on a visit to Harvard, and like, I have a few more of like Cornell and a couple more Ivies. Um, but like, my dream school is Vanderbilt, so hopefully, I'll obtain that one day. Um, but for the most part, I'm probably leaning towards like more the Ivies. So yeah. Sounds good. Yeah. Sounds good. Well, that's all the questions I have for you today. Thank you so much for joining. Thank um, you for having me. And, yeah, of course. And reporting for the Wolfcast, I'm Austin Makaborski. Back to you guys.